Hi, I'm over to All Scene Camera. We back to the channel with another one. We on that road to 10,000 subscribers. Sub up, we will be doing a giveaway. Today we're here to unbox or actually review some of the tour merch that we bought when we visited the Party Next Door tour. Sorry, I'm outside 2024 tour. We got some goodies. I've never started a video like this before. Already wearing one of the pieces we gonna review, but I had to throw the hat on. I fell in love. I had to throw one of the hats on. It feels perfect. If you got an afro, bushy hair, this is one that just fits perfectly. Like, you know, sometimes it's hard to find the right hat without it sliding up all the time. I'm like, nah, this hat fits perfect. We got some trucker merch coming out to this channel soon. I know I've been promising you guys merch for quite a minute. Bringing back my Hayamovi stuff. I took a ye I took two years off merch. And I've been dropping for so long. We coming back better than ever. But the one that we wearing right here is from the PND4. You guys know I told you I love that album. I've seen every Party Next Door tour. One, two, three, four. And ranking the albums in order. Not colors. Not none of the mix tapes. Just the party one, two, three, fours. For me it goes party two. Party one, party four, party three. And I like all of them. Even party three, which is ranked last in my list. Even that was fine. 1942 tequila, not nice, brown skin. Like there was just so much stuff on there that was gas. But that tells you how fire parties work is to me. We bought the vinyl as well too when we were there. The hat I paid 35 for. The vinyl we paid 30 flat for. Vinyl from party four. I needed this for my collection. I needed this for my collection. It's a one this side, A side, B. Side one has control, lose my mind. Stuck in my ways, cheers. Make it to the morning, no chill. Side B has her old friends, the retreat for certain. Sorry, but I'm outside. Real woman, a mother's prayer, family, and, and resentment. This is one of the craziest album covers of the year. I don't know how you guys feel about the actual album, but this album cover is super fire. <laughs> this album cover is super fire. And on a vinyl, oh, crazy. I just wanted this on a tee. I would have bought that as well. I would have bought another t-shirt, but he ain't. Some odd reason he did not sell that. That was an easy. That was an easy pull. Like you should have put this on a T-shirt. It's the back of the vinyl where you can see all the tracks listed to the right, to the bottom right hand corner, and then right in the middle you see party with the A, B, and Shorty bent over. We seen the photo shoot that she did for this. I forgot her name exactly, but I think it's Mommy Next Door. If so, I'll post it down. I'll post it down in this video so you guys can go show her some love. Fire! This is fire, and this album itself is fire. It's still in plastic. We're gonna play it on the vinyl. We actually just unboxed another vinyl today. Kanye Runaway with collectible posters, collectible artwork. That was so fire. We played that vinyl as well. And my favorite piece out of all the merch. So eighty-five dollars was the Party Next Door tour hoodie. He had the tour hoodie with, again, instead of the A, another position that we've seen her post up on her Instagram. Her spelled out the O for tour. On the back of it, we see the tour list. Her right butt cheek covers Miami Beach. That's the one that we were at. So that's how I always remember exactly where Miami is. Look for her butt cheek, Miami Beach, Florida. That's where we were at. But he went all over. Orlando, Phoenix. I believe the tour might still even be going. Maybe it's getting closer to the bottom of it. We also saw him in California. We saw him in Los Angeles and we saw him in Miami Beach. We saw him twice this year already. We saw a party March in Los Angeles. And we just saw a party once again in Miami Beach. And we saw a party once again at Miami Beach, Florida stop at the Fillmore. But this was the hardest piece of all. He sold a long sleeve t-shirt, he sold a t-shirt, and then he sold the hoodie. Three hats, I wanna say, three hats. And then he sold a crop top tee for girls. Two vinyls, colors, and PND4, I caught PND4. So all in total, we spent 150. 85 on the hoodie, 35 on the hat, and then 30 on the vinyl. We spent 150 on merch that day. The inside to this, let's see if he changed it. Yeah, he did. So I'll show you guys, let me take this out. And you know we always do zoom up details. I'll show you guys a lot better at the end, the inside tags and all. But looking at the tag inside, it's a screen printed tag. Party next door, large, machine wash, cold, tumble dry, low. Do not bleach, iron, 100% cotton, 30%, 100% cotton, 30% polyester. I don't know how that works. Made in China. And that's the tag right there. The hoodie itself is it's a heavy, heavy hoodie. So it's a good quality sweater. It's super thick. It's a nice hoodie. That's why when I felt it, I was like, yeah, nah, I need this fire. Again, I live in Miami. It's 90 degrees right now. It's been 90 degrees every day for the last month. I, can, I feel like it's not going to be hoodie season here that I can sneak off with it. This thick of a hoodie until until like October, which is cool because October is my birthday. So, you know, we have a brand new hoodie to pull out around October. So you got the heels on and oh, this is hard. This is hard. This time I got to wear the booby trap or something so they can know. Like, oh, yeah, I think y'all think y'all the first one I seen. Boss, if you guys went to any of the other stops, let me know down below how you felt about the show. Was you a fan? Was you not a fan? Did you buy any merch? If so, what did you get? I did not like the t-shirt. So I fell in love with this. The tour on the front of it is fire too. You look like tour staff. This shit is fire. Super hard. Nothing too crazy. I, you know, I don't like loud stuff on front and back. The front, centered, 
On the front of it, Tor with Shorty bent over and the braids on the ground, and then the back has the huge graphic. I always like one or the other. I usually don't like huge graphics on the front and the back. Fire, that's super dope. I like that a lot. Let me know down below your thoughts. Also, we're gonna play that vinyl, the hat. The hat, let's take a closer look at it as well. Let's take the hat, we'll do the zoom up details. I'll show you guys the in and out of the hat. I'm not sure how well you can see it. Again, I'll zoom up so you can see it a lot better, but this is the try on here. You can see the PND4 on it, and then right in the bottom of it, it says in the smaller scripture. So Sorry, I'm outside 2024 tour and then yeah, we'll show you guys a better look at the hat zoomed up Same thing with the vinyl. I'll zoom up to the vinyl. I'll show you the front and back zoomed up Let's look at how the actual vinyl inside looks. I want to play that See how that sounds as well. And then let's try this video. On. I personally believe I bought all the best merch. I wanted to buy a t-shirt as well so I could award during the summer. I just didn't like the shirt. The way it had the braids coming out the back of the collar, I just didn't like that design at all. Like, I don't know, I feel like it could have been executed better. I get it already with the braids and that's like the whole look of it with the girl's look. And that's probably one of the most memorable pieces of long braids from the front of it, that and her crack. But I feel like it could have been executed a whole lot better, a whole lot better. When I see merch pieces like that, sometimes it gets mad. It's like, damn, add me to your designer team, add me to your creative team. This, this was fire. This was fire. To the point that it, I bought this in July in Miami, knowing I'm not going to wear this for the next like four to five months, but I was like, nah, it's still hard. And when I back it out, no one's going to have it brand new like mine. So we keeping this. None of this is resale. You guys know when we go to merch, you know, you guys know when we go to artists that we love, love. Parties are my top five all time. Like parties are my top five all time. When it comes to the R&B list, party is on my top five all time when it comes to toronto r&b party is number one to me. party is number one to me. weekday weekend does not matter party is number one to me man love party next door on this channel subscribe to the channel we're on that road to 10,000. as soon as we get 10,000 subs you know we're always grabbing the best merch everywhere we go i will purchase something for someone on this channel you want to be part of it subscribe Let's go try this on. Let me know your thoughts down below. Have you been to any of the shows? If so, what city was you at? If so, what merch did you buy? Let me know down below. Let's go try this on. Hold on. One thing that I did forget to mention that I'll show you guys a lot better closer up at the end is this same blank used for parties merch. This same blank is the same blank. Oh, this blank trucker hat is the same. It's the same one that Chrome's uses. It's the same one that they charge you $600 a trucker hat. It's the same exact hat. Auto, I believe I'm saying it correct. O-T-T-O. -T -T That's the same exact hat they use as well. And this will be the exact same brand that we use for our merch, for our trucker hats coming in a couple weeks dropping on this channel. So think about it. If you like the Chrome trucker hats, if you like the Party Next Door trucker hat, the merch that I will be releasing real, real, real soon will be using these exact same trucker hats. So keep that in mind. All right, let's actually hear how this vinyl sounds. Let's open this up. I still even got the plastic on it. Let's get this open. Where's it open from here? Let's get that vinyl out. Oh, it's in a protective as well. That's dope. Okay. Did I break some? I didn't. I broke plastic. And then this is what it comes with inside. Okay, so then inside we have this wrap right here. And that's the back. Control, so it's showing you side A, side B. That's fire. Now let's see how the actual vinyl looks. You and then we got side B. I don't know how well you guys can see that. And then we got side B right there and side A. So the way you can tell the difference is side A is red one, two, it has the red lips on there. I like how you can easily read each track on here where the Kanye one was actually kind of hard for me to read. And then side B, her old friends, the retreat, no chill, all that. No, no chill is on side A. Yeah, side A. All right, cool. Let's put this here. <laughs> We also unboxed this one today. If you're curious to go check out that video, go check that out. But this is hard, bro. Came with artwork, came with everything inside. This is hard. We starting with the collection right. 
Oh yeah, cheers when we jump.